What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. If you're new here, my name is Joshua Kelme, and I'm assuming that you probably clicked on this video because you're looking for some good grooming secrets, tips. We have six grooming tips that every single guy should be doing out there. And if you're not, then there's something wrong. So let's get right into it. Starting at number one is something that all guys should be doing. If you want to feel confident, if you want to look good, if you want to get some compliments, this is my number one tip. Get a haircut. Haircuts are so important. I've noticed that when I don't get a haircut and I've let my hair grow for a little while and it's just a complete freaking mess, um, I notice as soon as I get a haircut, I feel 10 times better. So if you're someone out there that you might not feel confident at the moment, I encourage you to get out of the house, go get yourself a haircut, and I promise you that you're gonna feel 10 times better. What I would recommend is getting a full haircut every three to four weeks and then getting a shape up every two to three weeks. Tip number two is cut your nails. This one's huge, man. It's so important because that's one of the first things that people will realize when you shake their hands. You shake someone's hand, they're either looking at your hand or making eye contact with you. And you don't wanna be that guy that has all these crusty nails, absolutely disgusting. It's just not a good look. And I recommend cutting them every single week if you can, try to stay on top of them. Like I said, you don't want any dirt building up underneath them and no one wants to see some crusty hands. Tip number three is trim your nose hair. You don't want to be that guy that someone's having a conversation with and all they can notice is those long hairs in your nose. So what I would recommend is don't, don't pluck your hairs. That's going to hurt. It's going to feel uncomfortable and you're not going to want to do it again. Get yourself a nice nose trimmer. They make these super cheap on Amazon, which I'm going to link the one that I personally use down below in the description. And coming at number four is getting your eyebrows done. You don't want to be that guy that just looks like an absolute mess looks like you have caterpillars sitting on the top of your head don't want to be that guy i promise so personally what i like to do is i get my eyebrows threaded every three to four weeks and then in order to maintain them i just use a nice set of tweezers along with a nice pair of scissors to cut down the hair one thing that i've noticed is whenever i have my eyebrows done i tend to get a lot of compliments on them and people will say like wow nice eyebrows like you take good care of yourself and I promise you, if you do this, you're going to get compliments yourself and you're going to feel good. You're going to feel sharp. You have a nice shape up. You know, you got the nice haircut. You got the nice eyebrows. You get your beard done and stuff. This is the first thing that people see. People see your face. So make sure that you look good and you feel good. When you're talking to people, when you're having interactions, it's this is your money maker right here. So yeah, get your eyebrows done. Tip number five is wash your face. And if you aren't doing this, then what are you doing? Are you living under a rock? I personally like to wash my face first thing in the morning after my workout. This helps me keep my face feeling clean and fresh. And I also like to wash my face right before bed. This helps with cell turnover, revealing a fresh layer of skin while also giving you a natural glow. Yo, fellas, this one is huge because I honestly used to be that person that would only brush your teeth once. What did he say? And it would be first thing in the morning and then I'd forget to at night. Boy, this is not good. This is how you get cavities. And if you want to prevent some cavities, make sure you're brushing your teeth at night. Once in the morning, once at night. And if you're brushing your teeth at night, especially if you're brushing with a toothpaste that has some sort of whitening agent, it's going to help whiten your teeth. So that's it for me, guys. That's six grooming tips that you need to be incorporating. And if you're not, there is no excuses. Every single one needs to be implemented into your routine. You're gonna feel better, you're gonna look better, and people are gonna start to notice. So yeah, that's gonna be it. I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.